Doctor, I know uh, there's a lot of students right now who are a little worried about their grades, but Gateway has actually done a little something for them, which is kind of nice. And let's talk about that because, again, you wanted to ease some of their anxiety with all this going on. Absolutely. Uh, students are uh, our most concerned, uh, also uh, our employees as well, uh, because they're dealing with the students as well and uh, for their well-being and so forth. Um, as a district, uh, we came up with a policy that will address uh, grading for students. We understand that was almost uh, in the middle of the semester and some challenges they may face as far as completing their classes. Therefore, we came up with some opportunities for them to seek different grading uh, policies and, and, and procedures. Uh, our programs, though, um, many of them have the hands-on experiences and they're very comparative, uh, such as nursing and healthcare programs that we offer at the college. Uh, therefore, uh, the normal grading scale uh, was more beneficial to them. But we did give the students the options to select which option was best for them. Uh, of course, with the advice of the faculty and our uh, academic advisors. Yeah, and one thing we got to let the students know is that school is still going on uh, and they want you to continue the class. I know some are kind of been doing that and some might have like said, well, I'm going to take the break too, which is good. But you guys said we understand that and you want to make sure the students are doing their classes. Absolutely. We had uh, three groups of uh, modalities that they were going on uh, when uh, COVID-19 uh, happened. One was the online courses, which uh, those never stopped. Uh, they kept going. Uh, then we had a hybrid modality, which was uh, some instruction took place on campus, some uh, virtually. Um, and then we had the face-to-face -face courses. Uh, uh, our challenge was the clinical uh, component of, of those and the hands-on component for a lot of our black hour programs. Uh, so those were all converted to fully online. So the ones that they were in, uh, fully online or hybrid, uh, it was not that difficult of a transition into a fully online environment. Uh, the other ones were interrupted the face-to-face -face for a couple of weeks. Actually, uh, we were grateful we had the spring break week, so it gave us a little bit more room to prepare and, uh, and move all those courses fully online. So uh, right now, and from what we can see in the student reaction, uh, pretty much everyone is uh, continuing with their studies, uh, business as, uh, as usual. Yeah, I talked with Dr. Diaz about a summer program, um, and that's where, again, you guys are putting together um, curriculum for the summer school, and the teachers are making those adjustments, especially when it comes to those um, pretty much in-person classes you need to do, but they're, they're making some changes so they still get credit for them, am I right? Absolutely, yes. Uh, faculty have uh, been fabulous. They stepped up to the plate and uh, they converted in a very short period of time courses that they were traditionally face-to-face -to, -face, uh, to fully online. So uh, kudos to them and also to our students for adapting uh, so quickly uh, to these changes. Uh, we are uh, uh, experiencing several stressors and uh, being at home and with several other individuals, which is an environment you didn't used to be or study before, that creates some added challenges, but uh, everyone has stepped up to the plate and uh, we're delivering uh, as, uh, as promised. All right. And do you want the students to go right to, of course, the uh, Gateway website to get information more on what they need to do and maybe find out what the teacher is doing? Absolutely. And our faculty communicate directly with our students uh, that they're in their classes. Uh, so we have multiple channels of communication. Uh, we want them to go to our Gateway website because they are Gateway students so uh yeah that's the best way thank you doctor very much not a problem my pleasure so, okay you have a great day yeah.